YouTube, what it do, baby? We're back again for episode number 20 of our Pokemon Hard Go Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. Now, ladies and gentlemen, in the last episode, we got some very lackluster encounters. We ended off with something semi-decent. Y'all, again, y'all have been absolutely smashing the support lately, and thank y'all so much. I really do greatly appreciate everything. All the likes, comments, and shares that y'all give me, it just absolutely means the world to me. Subbing to the channel as well. Like I said, uh, at the end of last episode, at the time I'm recording this, we're almost at 300 subs, and that just blows my mind. Now, we're going to jump into the game today. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to hopefully be making it to the Lake of Rage. Hopefully, we'll be finding out what our uh, random shiny is. But, before we jump into that, y'all, please, question of the day. What Pokemon game did you find to be the easiest out of all of them so far? Let me know. I'm curious. With that being said... Let's jump into the game, get a quick team recap. And before we do that, ladies and gentlemen, please like the video, comment down below, and share it with a friend. Let me know how y'all liking it. Let another friend like it. But <laughs> let's get a quick team recap. Now, ladies and gentlemen, starting off strong with our number one, we're rocking out with Snapper, the Grotal, rocking that overgrow ability. He's got Bite, Curse, Leaf Storm, and Razor Leaf. Up next is our Sparky with Static Ability, Rock and Discharge, Thunder Wave, Cotton Spore, and Fire Punch. I believe, believe he might evolve today. He might. Uh, up next is Poseidon. Poseidon's not really on the team, but I'll give him the proper introduction. We have Poseidon, our, our Fione, with the Hydration Ability, Rock and Bubble, Water Sport, Surf, and Supersonic. Like I said, he's taking Jack the Ripper spot just for right now, just so we can surf across. I didn't have anybody else that can learn surf. Up next is KFC, the kicking chicken with that blaze ability, rock and fire punch, peck, double kick, and cut. Up next is our big boy, our Drogon with that intimidate ability, rock and bite, aurora beam, headbutt, and fly. And then next is our baby, Mr. Riddle with that hyper cutter ability, rock and sand attack, fire punch, fan attack, and rock throw. Now, let's, uh, we ended off right here getting our encounter last episode, so let's, uh, Let's just keep on pushing forward and see what happens. Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. No. Don't tell me I get a chance to catch it. I don't think... No, I'm not getting a chance at this right now. I believe he's just going to see me and run, right? It's the Sweet Sweet. Hey, bro, you ain't have to headbutt me like that. Oh, big dude wants to come. Are you going to battle me now? Sweet Room. Hey, how brave is it? How refreshing is it? How beautiful is it? And how quickly it moves! Really, you seem to be around when Suicune would appear. Well, yeah, that's okay. My desire to search for Suicune is beyond yours. My grandpa was quite in the mist and uh, heard so many stories about Suicune from him. Suicune! <laughs> I won't stop following you until I found out what you're after. You hear me? <laughs> hey. <laughs> But he got that. If I can't have it, no one can. <laughs> Let's get some apricot cords right quick. Oh. I am also working on doing better voices for them. Uh, as the series goes on, I, I would like to be able to be do better voices for other people. Uh, just as I, I want that to be, uh, be known. I know the voices I do right now aren't exactly the best. But I am trying. I promise. I, I am trying very hard. I, is my luck gonna change with this? Uh, with these random? No, that answers my question. It's not the the random uh the random uh, items still are trash. <sighs> eventually, eventually I will get something that's halfway decent and I'll be okay with it. Hey, I build them. I am. I am, want you to know. As amazing as a Metagross would be on the team, I am glad I did not run into you. 100% happy about that. Because you have a legendary catch rate. And the only move you know is takedown. So yeah, I am A-OK -okay with the fact I did not run into a belt. I'm pretty sure Metagross has a, a, a higher catch rate than Beldum does. Beldum's catch rate is absolutely insane All right hidden item hidden item it's got to be hidden item a potion ah 
I just have zero luck with these items. I have zero luck. One step into the water, too. Sorry. So. What? Excuse me, bitch. Arceus just chilling in the water. Oh, shit. Does that hurt? No, it doesn't hurt. Just an, an Arceus. This is a legendary pool of water right here, okay? It has a Beldum, which has a legendary catch rate, and then it has the literal god of Pokemon here. Wow. <clears throat> I want to throw... <laughs> part of me is like, throw a ball, see what happens. The other part of me is like, no, because if I catch it, I'm going to be way too tempted to be like, yep, we have an Arceus now. And I, that is the last thing I need to be doing. So let's just get rid of him and just... <laughs> I do... Part of me wanted to be like, we're using our token. But I, I don't want to be that guy. I, I, I'd i prefer to call my token encounter before I, I run into it. But... <laughs> Imagine an Arceus. An Arceus. That would have been insane. It's a prime ape. You don't have your evolution yet. Fun fact, his evolution, cool as shit. I love it. I'm gonna hit you with a karate chop. Brodel, you're so close to evolving. Like, I'm I'm ready to see that big beautiful Torterra. Uh what is that? That I don't remember how much damage that's supposed to do. I think that's a set damage move, but I can't remember how much it's supposed to do. All right, so Snapper, you are a uh, a wee bit low on HP. Oh, never mind. I thought he had more than one. We are still going to swap you. Uh, uh, no. No. No, I don't want your number. I want you to know, I have enough people that call me, and it pisses me off when they call me now. I don't know how, as a kid, I was okay with that. The Getting the phone calls. I, oh, is this a double battle? You got your spectacles on, Mr. Sir? No, he doesn't. Oh, well. All right, so Flaffy, let's get you enough experience and hopefully evolve. Parasect. I want you to know, Parasect, I used to never have any issue with Parasect. I thought Parasect was a cool mon until Pokemon Legends Arceus came out. And then Parasect was just a bane of my existence. And I just, I hate Parasect now. If any of y'all have played Legends Arceus, y'all know, y'all know the exact reason why I hate it. Y'all, y'all know. I right, Piplup. I would not. I would tell you right now, if I could find a Piplup or that line, I would love to have that on the team. I really would. I think Piplup is an amazing Pokemon. It's just, it's, it's one of those, it's weird because Piplup is so fucking amazing that but they just kind of get overshined by the other mons on the, the, the other starters. I feel like Piplup is the least chosen out of the three. Let's go. What? What is this? What is evolution? No, I'm just kidding. We stop. We have an Ampharos now. Sweet. That is awesome. That is what we call beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Sparky has evolved. Are you going to learn a new move? Thunder Punch. I think you're more of a physical attacker now, so that might be taught to you. Let's see. Attack and spec. No, your special attack is still way higher. Mm, I think I'm going to keep Fire Punch for coverage because your physical attack is nowhere near your special. Yeah, we're not going to learn Thunder Punch. Now, I have Fire Punch. That's coverage and then Discharge for your special attack. Yeah, we're good. All right. Um, I don't want to battle you. Let's go. We got a nice little Evo for the team. All right. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I got to make my way up here. Let me pull Jack the Ripper on out. No, I got to keep Poseidon. I got to I gotta get up there and surf. Uh, maybe we'll get a new encounter up here. Uh, Technically, we can get a... uh encounter in this town uh we did say that if we could do the headbutt encounters we can get another token encounter 
So I might just do that at the end of this episode. Come over here and can I headbutt that tree? No. I'll probably come over here and headbutt one of these trees and get an encounter and then have a have another token for in the back in the back pocket and then at some point we'll decide what we want to do for encounters. I will say I just want to run straight up here. Can I just run straight up here? Team Rocket Yeah, I was about to say is Team Rocket blocking this off. Hold it right there, kiddo. The total is a thousand and thank you very much. Oh, you just, so you just take my money? You just took my money and, and didn't give me the option. Okay. Lemonade. Again. An item I didn't need. Alright, so Route 43, what do we got? Route 43, our encounter is. Wait. No, I don't have Oddish. Never mind. I thought I caught Oddish and Oddish in the, the last route. Or not last route. The, uh, what's called the route? But it wasn't Oddish. I caught Shroomish on that route. It had Oddishes with it. Because I said I wouldn't have been mad at either one of those. But I don't need a grass type right now. Oh, you're just going to poison powder me. Okay. Uh, okay. Bro, look at that HP stat right now. Holy shit. Um, I th I'm going to say F Poseidon probably is the best bet here because he's low enough level to hit it. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go with Poseidon and let Poseidon hit it. I mean, technically at this point, he's just fodder. So, I mean, if he, if he dies, he dies. I don't think he'll die, but if he does, it's not like it's detri detrimental to the team. He's literally just there so we can use Surf. Bro, this is what I hate about these mods. Some of them just are just here to watch things like this happen and make make things go by fat. Take longer to do. Hit it with surf. Are you shitting me right now? Ah, double pair. Both of us are paralyzed. Thank you. Please don't crit. Let me catch this. Thank you. That's what I wanted to see right there. All right, so you must have all the powders. All right, we are going to hit you with a, a quick little Pokeball real quick, like. I'm going to have to run back and heal. Just because I got I'm poisoned and paralyzed. Let's go. Gloom has been caught. Not the most, like, interesting Pokemon in the world, but it, it's, it's decent enough. It's decent. Let's see. I don't. What do we name a gloom? What do we name a gloom? I'm gonna just. I'm gonna name you. Fl I'm gonna name you Sun. Can I? Will Sunflower fit? Will Sunflower fit? I think it will. We're gonna name you Sunflower. Because if you go into a blossom, you're a sunflower. But even if you stay as a, uh, what is the other one? What's the other one's name? Uh, whatever. I'm I'm spacing on the names right now. I'm sorry. I'm tired. I forgot. What is his damn name? It's blossom and bioplume. There we go. I was thinking victory bell, and I knew that was wrong. In my head, I was like, it's victory bell. I was like, no, it's not. I'm over here having an internal crisis inside of my brain. All right, but I mean, file plume is good. Also, I checked the TM that we got from Shuckle. TM78 is Sacred Fire. I want to teach it to Blaze again. It can learn it, but here's the here's the issue. It only has five PP, and I don't want to I don't want to do that at the moment. Let's check out uh. Sunflower, do you have an item for us? A yellow shard. Didn't need it. But I'm going to take it. But the PC is filling up. The PC is filling up quite nicely. Hopefully, here in just a few minutes, we are going to get a pretty damn cool shiny Pokemon. Or at least I'm hoping. I'm hoping we get a, a random shiny. I'm not going to lie to you. If I get up here and it's a shiny Gyarados, I'm I'm going to leave it up to y'all chat. Chat. It's not chat. Quit saying that. 
Sorry, I'm I'll be in streamer mode. I stream over on Twitch. Y'all gotta pay a thousand dollars every time I come over here. Bro, y'all are annoying. Get out of my way. But yeah. If uh if it oh damn it. If it is a shiny Gyarados, I'm gonna let y'all decide down in the comments below if I just keep it. Because technically I have a shiny clause. So even if it is a shiny Gyarados. Ooh. Didn't want to see you. Glade, you're strong. You're scary. But yeah, I have a shiny clause regardless. So even if it is Gyarados, I'm going to say it counts as an encounter. I will also let y'all decide down below if y'all think uh, y'all think that I'm just cheesing it for a good, a good water type. Let me know. I don't mind. But a shiny Gyarados, I would not mind going on the squad. Like, who... Is everybody level 30 now? I feel like... I feel like Drogon's not level 30 yet. I feel like he's not. All right, yeah. Drogon, come hit level 30. I do know we need to do a bit of grind. Damn it. I was trying to avoid that. I was trying. Oh, do we have a rival battle up here? The only thing on my mind right now is a, a potential shiny. So that's really the only thing I'm thinking about. But do we have a rival battle up here? Question mark. Because I don't I don't recall. We're going to bite you. I will say, Drogon has, has only attempted to learn one other move. And that one other move was Ember. And I just did not see the point in giving it, it Ember over anything. So I would like Drogon to learn a Dragon type move. That would really, really make my day. But... You know, beggars can't be choosers and whatnot. I will come back and battle all of these people at some point. The Gyarados is angry. It's a bad omen. Well, that's fine. Okay, so technically this is Lake of Rage. So I get an encounter here, but I want this encounter first. Our shiny Gyarados is. Is it a shiny Gyarados or is it something else? I mean, I mean, it's a, sh it's a shiny, it's lantern. I don't mind lantern. It's not bad. It's not the, it's not the powerhouse I wanted. It's the powerhouse I got though. I feel like you can live a headbutt. You can live a headbutt. Right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I mean, at the end of the day, it's still, it, it's, it's a sparkly boy. All right, so let's, uh, oh, that's a boosted bubble beam in the rain. Okay, we can headbutt you one more time. Okay, we cannot do that again. We cannot do that again. But, I'm not mad at, I'm not, I'm not mad at the encounter. I was just hoping for something, something insane. Some, something, something crazy. Not a lantern. First ball magic. Let's go, baby. Shiny lantern has been acquired. Not mad at that. Huh. Now to name you. What do we name a shine? I'm going to just call you shine. Just going to call you shine. Because why not? Why not? You shiny. You, you're shining. Obtained a red scale. Cool. Don't really need that. All right, so let's get our Lake of Rage encounter. So we got our shiny encounter. So let's get our Lake of Rage encounter. Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? Hey, uh, did y'all forget that there's Pokemon here? Really? What is going on right now? That is in all right. Let's talk to let's talk to Lance. Maybe he'll activate the Pokemon again. The red Gyarados wasn't acting uh, right, as I feared. Smile must have forced it to evolve. Did you come here because of the tail? You're Riddler. I'm Lance, a trainer like you. 
I heard some uh, rumbling, so I came to investigate. I saw you was on the battle you battled earlier. I can tell you're a trainer that is considerably skilled. If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? Sure. Excellent. It seems that the Lake of Rage Magic Carp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mag Magnolia Town is probably the cause. It's a suspicious souvenir shop. I'll be waiting for you in the Magnolia. Okay. Okay. All right. Will that reactivate the encounters up here? Because I, I kind of feel like that's that's not how it should be, right? Right? I feel like I should get an encounter in here. Okay. Lake of Rage encounter is... What does the Lake of Rage encounter hold for... Ooh, a Stormy. We're turning... We're turning around with the, with the semi-decent encounters now. I am I am not upset with a star me. I will say I will headbutt you and hope for the best. Okay. <laughs> I hope for the best and it happened. <clears throat> Alright, so let's see. Can we catch this? I don't I have terrible nicknames tonight. I'm sorry, I'm blanking. All of my creative brains for like nicknames are just gone right now. Okay. I was I I, I couldn't tell if I caught that or not. Starmie wouldn't be bad to add to the team either. Starmie wouldn't be bad to have on the team. But Lantern wouldn't be bad either. I mean, we already have an electric type, so we don't really need it. So that might just... I hate leaving shinies in the PC, though. Oh, well. <clears throat> oh, well. If... Because I do want to... I, I want a water type on the team. That's... One of the main reasons like I considered putting Poseidon on the team was because I wanted I wanted to be able to say I got coverage for all typings. And unfortunately, Ripper just doesn't give you that extra level of typing because it's a normal type and it doesn't really do much to others. So I wanted to be able to add something different for coverage. So Starmie might make an appearance. Maybe. I do know... I need to reevaluate my options. I need to figure out what I'm going to do. Let's go. Starmie was caught. That's what you like to see, ladies and gentlemen. I, I am going to be reevaluating the team. Uh, I like my team a lot, but I do definitely think that uh, Ripper's probably not going to be staying on the team. I'm going to name you Misty because I'm pretty sure Misty had one of you in... In the anime so we're gonna call you misty a little bit of throwback some nostalgia right there um <clears throat> oh, 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 oh hey random item let's, let's get that one real quick but yeah um it, it it hurts me because like i really do like ripper i do he's he's been with me from the start protector i could i wonder if i if if that, I don't remember how the uh, ROM was set up for trade evolutions. So maybe I can use that to go and uh, evolve our Rhydon into a Rhyperior, which would not be bad neither. But I I don't want to just you know like throw Ripper away because Ripper is a good mon and he's he's gotten us out of a couple sticky situations. But the biggest issue with Ripper is the fact that at the end of the day, type coverage, he just doesn't have it. He has a really good attack stat, and he's going to be good to be in the PC to, to pull back if, if we need him. But <clears throat> I'm almost positive our next episode, we will have somebody instead of Ripper. Um, You want to fight? You want to give me a... Yeah. I was hoping he was going to give me the Super Rod or the Great Rod. Your good rod, whichever one it is. I was hoping for that, but you know, beggars can't be choosers. Why do you have a level 10? Everyone else has had level 19s up. I should have roar beam. But everybody else has had level 19s up to this point. Why do you have a level 10 in this area? That makes no sense. At all. Whatever. <sighs> Whatever. 
but yeah, um, well, I, I will reevaluate what's going to be on the team and what we're going to do. Uh, I think we're going to fly back to the town and that will be where we wrap things up. In the next episode, we should be knocking out the team rocket encounters and we'll just, uh, we'll see who does what who remains on the team, who doesn't stay on the team because, uh, we got some reevaluations to do. And I don't know who's getting reevaluated to what position. I know we didn't get our uh, our Mongolian town. I I am tired. I need to I need to chill out. <laughs> uh, our Magnolia town encounter. Also protect no, an attacking move, please. <sighs> So uh, we will probably start the next episode off with catching that encounter for our token. Uh, I kind of don't want to have to catch it. I want to just say I get a token for that. But, you know, the way I kill encounters, it's probably best for me to be like, yeah, we need. Oh, shit. I, I need that extra level of uh, protection saying that I actually caught the encounter rather than killed it. So let's get down here and we will end things off. So let's jump right over here. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much again for all the love and support y'all been showing the channel lately. Uh, y'all are just absolutely incredible. But thank you all so much. Y'all remember, please like the video, share it with a friend, sub to the channel. That really lets me know that y'all are enjoying the content. Answer the question of the day, ladies and gentlemen, until Friday. Thank y'all. I love y'all. Bye.